Oka now says he is not aware of what he signed in the Azimio Oka deal on Saturday. The former vice president says many political parties in the deal were and are still not aware of the content of the deal. And as Mike Kagwongo now reports, the Raila Odinga campaign secretariat has dismissed Kalonzo's claims saying that the deal was not between Azimio and One Kenya Alliance. <laughs> Waipa Democratic Movement Party leader Kalonzo Musioka on Monday said the agreement he signed at KICC Nairobi during the endorsement of Raila Odinga was not smoothly done. Kalonzo says the deal was forced and hurried, adding that many of the parties that signed the deal may have not understood the content. Even what people signed at KICC, if I ask all those secretaries general, what did they affix their signatures to? Probably nobody knows. Okay, that's why the whole thing, even when uh, uh, the director of elections, ODM, Kijanayetu Junet Mohammed, was looking for a proposal for Raila to become Azimio La Umoja candidate. Now you see, and yet we have agreed that the, political, the new political outfit is Azimio Oka, is Azimio One Kenya. So ideally it should have been proposed as such. If that had happened, if this thing was not rushed like it was, we would then all have come as one Kenya alliance to sign. Because, quite frankly, my Secretary General did not sign the second document because it was specific about uh, Azimio. <laughs> we were not Azimio. So what was passed there, Raila Odinga was given a ticket as presidential candidate of Azimio at KICC. Oka principals Mother Karua and Cyrus Jirongo skipped the event that was only attended by their colleagues, Kanu Chairman Gideon Moy and Kalonzo Musioka. Does it favor her? Because she must ask herself that question. If the new configuration works to her disadvantage, of course she'll be at liberty to say, my friends, I don't think I want to sign this coalition political party. We had ourselves even as a as uh, Oka wanted to register as a coalition political party. But we realized the moment we do that, it might mean, among other things, that Kanu, Waipa, Na Kenya, and the other parties, UDP, may have to wind up. We said, no, no, no. All the political parties must run their own candidate. He revealed that during the Saturday meeting, parties were hurriedly presented with two documents to sign. He opens that the Saturday event was rushed in a confusing process and his allies at Oka opted to take a back seat before signing the agreement to assess the practicality of joining the pact. The whole thing was, 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 was confusing because they were there to, to, to announce Raila as a flag bearer or presidential candidate of Azimio La Umoja. Now, th that thing has shifted to Azimio One Kenya. According to Musioka, the ODM Director of Elections, Junet Mohamed, introduced a second document to have the parties propose Raila Odinga as the presidential candidate of Azimio La Umoja. Odinga's campaign spokesman, Professor Makao Mutua, however, has refuted the claims of the current confusion affirming that the One Kenya Alliance did not join the Azimio La Umoja movement, but only individual political parties signed the coalition agreement. So what was signed on Saturday was an agreement to form the Azimio Coalition Party. Okay, that is what was signed on Saturday. Um, secondarily, let me just say that uh, political parties come to Azimio as individual political parties. They don't come as alliances or coalitions. So, you know, whether it was WIPA, whether it was KANU, whether it was ODM, they all signed onto that agreement as individual political parties. Professor Mutua opened that a coalition could not sign to join another coalition, hence only the WIPA party and not OKA signed the deal. According to Registrar of Political Parties and Rito, a coalition political party shall only be formed by parties and not by other coalitions. No political party shall be in two different coalition parties. What is important, uh, ladies and gentlemen, and for all Kenyans, is in fact the critical step of more of 24 political parties uh, joining together with the clarity of mind that we are going this way, we are as a meal, 
and our presidential candidate is Raila Amolo Odinga. The former vice president noted that his party declined to sign the part of the agreement as the earlier agreement stated that the coalition would be named as a Mio One Kenya Alliance. However, Kalonzo and his Oka Co principles will be forced to retreat to review the legal technicalities of the Saturday agreement, which 26 political parties, including the WIPA party, officially signed the coalition agreement committing to work with Azimio La Umoja movement. I don't know our lawyers, one of them being myself, will have to really reflect on the technicality, that legal technicality. What, however, is clear is going forward, we hope in the next few days to register as Mio One Kenya as a political, as a coalition political party. The secretaries of the various parties also signed a commitment document to support Raila Odinga's candidature. In the deal, Kalonzo says NAC Kenya party leader was hesitant and uncomfortable with the legal technicalities. Kalonzo now blames the 2017 agreement between himself and Raila Odinga for his remarks on being a fool should he support Odinga for the third time. The reason I kept on saying I'd be a big fool is because I knew of the contents. Because that document said whether we won or lost in 2017, in 2022 Raila Odinga was going to support our candidature. But that is now water under the bridge. I can sleep soundly because I let Kenyans know why I was saying I was a I would be a big fool because I had this document in my position. He, however, says the deal did not include the running mate. Kalonzo recently accused Odinga of failing to honor their 2017 agreement. Mike Kagwongo TV 47.